Hi, and welcome to a new video. So, a thing that you might see, or like just know if you're new to Scratch, is that if you go through something, if you have a basic movement system, I have a video on that, so if you don't have one, I'd check that out. I, you would just normally go through it. Like if I take out this code, look at this, you go through. But I have some simple code here that will simply prevent any any of that. So you need your player and what you want to collide, and then if touching, and then the thing you want to collide with. So I've just made a few lines, and then we're going to make two variables: old x, old y. And if touching is right one, we're going to go to old x and old y. But if we're not touching, we're going to constantly set our current position to that. So as soon as we touch it, we're just going to stay in that position till we're not. So yeah, if touching to right one, go to old x and old y. And if we're not, set old x to x position and set old y to y position. Make sure the x is going to go to x and the y is going to y. And yeah, try that out. And no if there are any problems, but bam, we are colliding. Perfectly with the wall. It works in all directions. See? So, yeah. This helped. Smash like and subscribe if you want more good tutorials. So, yeah, thanks. And goodbye.